Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of uh, Derby County Career Mode. Uh, we had a good episode in the last one. A good episode. I need to word out how I'm going to say that. Um, but there was a bit, well, I say there was a bit. I've got a little bit of concern with how Rooney and Marriott are playing. They, they seem to, like... I don't know, Marriott seems to lose confidence whenever Rooney's on the pitch. But as soon as I sub Rooney off, Marriott comes to life. But then in the last game, they, they seem to work well together in tandem. So, I don't know, it, it's, a, it's a, a weird one. But something that I'm sure will sort itself out over time. They just need to get used to playing, like, Marriott needs to just get used to having Rooney play behind him. Pretty impressive stats. Holmes, Marriott, challenges for the ball, saw the pass Yoink. and dealt with it, this to put them ahead, that's a bit, get in, the beautiful goal. goal, nice bit of team play with everyone there, between Holmes, Marriott and Plasvik, Plasvik, however you say his name, oh nice little, um, well, it looks simple, I saw Celeste's triangle I guess, right look at that, nice little bit of play, Marriott drew some of the right defenders side. away to him, because everyone thought they were going to pass to him. Again. I thought I was going to pass for him. But then I decided just to try the shot instead. And it worked. Look at that. Beautifully done. That's his first goal in it, I think. Okay, it's his third goal. It's the second goal for Sheffield Wednesday. 37 minutes played. 2-0. That's Alan McAnally keeping us bang up to date. This could bring them level. No. Well done, Adam. Oh, crap. It went in. I thought Avocado saved it. Just shifted. Crap. Goalkeeper almost got there, but it wasn't a strong enough touch. Yeah, he's annoyed with himself, isn't he? Crap, how do you not save that? Feels he should have done better. Oh, come on. That is ridiculous. I thought he saved it. He did save it. Oh, that is a... Uh, I don't know what to say about that goal. For Derby County... They'll be facing oh, Nottingham ref. Forest. Thank you. This okay. Is Ooh. This range. is where I could do with Wayne Rooney, actually. I, I don't Sliding think I can make the sub either, can I? Oh, well. Who was that as a free kick? Plasma, okay. Really. Uh, I know it drives some fans mad. 76, 65, 71. Everybody likes to see that kind of challenge, but so often players okay. get pulled up Okay, Plasovic, show me what you can do. Had a go! Ooh, and he's made the close. Save, and it was a pretty Still don't know how to fully take free kicks properly. I don't understand what the right analog stick does. Opportunity now, maybe. Actually, I'm going to try a uh, crowd keeper. In goes the corner. Oh! So that is one of the most difficult skills. Oh my game. God, and Max Low, take a bow! Holy it's crap! <laughs> This is a what brilliant the goal we'll see over and over again. Wonderful improvisation. Well, the oh my god. And so are the opponents. His teammates Max Lowe. Freaking hell. Who's that? Well, Wisdom could have pinched that. But no, my god, Max Lowe. <laughs> Freaking hell. Oh my god. I'm lost for words. What a goal. Jesus Christ. Can we just watch that again? Holy crap. Uh, instant replay. Uh, start tele orbital, obviously. Hide. Rotate. Zoom in. Look at him getting his position. He's like, I see it, I see it, I see it. Spring. And look at him running towards it, running towards it. He jumps. Nearly knocks B the cat with the kick. Some Matrix style stuff there. And then look at Wisdom. He's like, do I nick it? Do I nick it? Do I nick it? What do I do? What do I do? Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Even though it did touch Wisdom, it went through his ankle up. Boom. But it still counts as a freaking Max Low goal. And what a goal that was. Oh, my God. No, why? What? No. It wouldn't let me swap to a different player. Oh, my freaking God. Go away. I'm not happy with that, man. I don't want to watch it. Boo. Okay, guys. So, we ended up drawing that one. Um, 
after being in the lead both times, we could see the two, well, one good goal. That goal was a, I can't fault that one, but that goal, it shouldn't have been a goal. It, it wouldn't, it kept switching to the different player that I wanted to swap it to. But my God, Max Lowe with the goal, man. Jeebus Christ, what a freaking bicycle kick that was. How did Forrest do? They won 2-0. We're playing Forrest next. Yay. The Derby Derby. Or the East Midlands Derby for the Brian Clough Trophy. Okay, we better Just praise Max Lowe. Uh, we should have won. We should have. Uh, when, the Middles Middlesbrough, blah, blah, blah. when the Middlesbrough equaliser came in the second half, did you hope to get back in front? Uh, we aim to win each match. I'm sure I pressed skip then. Uh, Ayala was one of the best players in the opposition. Is his confident displaying defence? Uh, concentrate on what we can do better. I'm sure Ayala's... Um, is it, Dan is it Danny Ayala? I'm sure he's an ex-Derby player. We had him years ago. Right, Wagon wants to play. Okay. He's not moving up to uh, 59, Davis isn't. That's quite worrying. Right, we're not interested in youth development with some port. Right, I had a look at the... Uh, oh, wow. Two emails about it's not being on track. They're spending our brand. Okay, so I need to sign a crucial forward in the January transfer window. Uh, you, you still play... I'm counting on you. I'll let you play... Well, I can't. That's because it's a derby. Actually, I can put you on the right-hand side. I think. Hey, Gaff, uh, I really want this to let me play while I'm in form. Uh, I'm going to say keep it up. Yeah, I was looking at the um, the board objectives. And one of them is signing to, to youth players to a defender position. And then sign at least three players. Brand exposure, I need to sign one crucial first team player to sign for a forward position. Uh, so I'm going to try and do that in January. Uh, where's my shortlist? So I think I've got a striker. I know I've got a few that I'm scouting at the minute. Uh, yeah, so I've got two strikers. But, like, they, they cost an arm and a leg to buy. Uh, but I'm sure... I think I've got a few more scouting. So I, I need to just, like, do that to keep the board happy that does seem like a quite an easy one to be able to do hopefully these scout reports will have a, a decent striker that I can try and steal off a team and then I think with the youth squad I'm getting right players leaving on international duty Rooney and Bielik okay that's fine so delete that uh, final scout report on everything Angus right these are all um Midfielders that I'm looking for just to fill the bench. So I'm going to potentially... Wow. 19 and he's an exciting prospect. And he's 70 rated. And he's another free kick taker. Interesting. Uh, showing great potential. 4 million. Yeah, these are all just players that I'm looking to fill out the midfield a bit more. Because I think that's where I'm lacking stuff. Interesting. He could be my signing in January. Or him. That's not a bad uh, stat either. 22 years old, 69. So there's plenty of chance for him to uh, to grow. Have I got any strikers? No. Right, found scout report on Leonardo Perez. Okay. <clears throat> he looks quite mean, he does. Again, I'm going to shortlist him. Just, I know I can't afford it. I might be able to get him on loan, maybe. Uh, we'll get you scouted as well. Oh, I can't end scouting. He's on loan. Okay, so we'll get rid of you. Detailed info. No. Okay, so I don't have no uh, freaking strikers on the scouts list. So I'm going to go ahead and do Thank that before. Thank you for your We'll start taking uh, questions now. Are you prepared for the next match? Uh, I'm going to play mind games with Forrest. It's... Uh, Inconsistent results. We're not inconsistent. We're we're unbeaten. Derby. Are, we're not on a bad form, and they've not asked me once about the Derby game, like how 
how okay, we guys, prepared for the Derby. Like, it's Thank not in Forest, it's Derby County. It's the biggest game of the season for us. And they're not asked us. But anyway, guys, before I go into that game, I am going to have a look for some strikers to scout and whatnot. As you see, I've got a few here and probably go through the search players list. So I'll see you all at the end of the Forest game. Okay, thank you. Right. Can go in from here. The okay, camera got Rooney that's open. <coughs> Damn it. Oh, man. I'm... Let me grab some cough medicine. That was <coughs> a good uh, cross. Rooney was in loads of space then. Just shame that I should have controlled it first. I had plenty of time. No great danger here. They've got the ball. That's the most important. No chance to go in front. Of course they do. Of course they freaking score. Avocado, what are you doing? I don't believe that. How is it? Until they did have an opening. What a marvellous goal. From that angle as well. Come on, Avocado. You should have caught that. It's a lovely bit of play between these two. Come on, Wisdom. Come on, Marriott. Rooney! Rooney! Get in. He scored against Nottingham Forest. Welcome to your first East... Yeah. Can't even talk. Welcome to your first East Midlands derby, Wayne Rooney. Sorry, guys. I've had a, um, a Bombay pot, bad boy pot noodle, and it's burnt all my tongue. I added a load of extra hot sauce into it, <coughs> and I've really burnt my tongue. <laughs> So, my tongue feels really extra thick, and then my lips, you know, when you've had hot sauce, and your lips are like, you just can't touch them, they just don't feel anything. That's how I feel at the minute. But well done, Wayne Rooney, lovely gold. Look at the night, the strength in him. No, Clark, that was yours. No, no! Oh my god. <coughs> Freaking out. Yeah, go away. How? That was dirty. And again, Avocado, I'm dropping him in the next game. Right, guys, so we've lost that one, 2-1. One. Um, I'm not happy with Avocado. I forgot they have uh, Costa Pantillion on. That's interesting, though, that they've got him instead of... Uh, Sam uh, what's his face? Samba. But no, yeah, where am I going? I'm not happy with Avocado in that game, or the last two games actually. He just can't catch a ball. He'd rather punch it or slap it out of the way rather than catch it. And just it's cost him too many mistakes. Right. Pasvik is continuing his hot run of form. He deserves all the praise. Do you think the score was fair? Uh, yes, it was. Forest were a good team. After they got ahead in the second half, Dad, Dad, well, so you, we played well, but it wasn't enough. Thanks, well played. We did struggle in the first half. Like the moral just seemed to completely vanish. Um, but I'm not happy with freaking Avocado. He, uh, it's frustrated me. Right, uh, Davis. I think I'm going to swap your no. Oh, that's a point. I can put my other midfielder in, can't I? But Davis. I want to change your set piece uh, to. Let's go for vision and short pass. Uh, I think I'm going to take out uh, Jason Knight because he's going to start growing whilst I play him. Uh, Wow, look at this. Palliard, man. Can't wait for him to turn 16. Uh, what's it? Free kick accuracy, 74. Wowza. Uh, what do I want to... Oh, 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 he's a centre midfielder. Uh, let's work on this, I guess. Attack position, finishing, short pass and shot power. Let's work on that for a bit. Bird's gone up. <coughs> Felix gone up, which is good. Um, so as soon as Bird hits 65, I'm going to take him out. And then I think when Bielik hits 75, I'm going to take him out. Right, what's the emails? Uh, Graham Shinny, I'm happy with him at football. You're welcome. I'm proud of you. Um, oh, yeah. I had a look on my scout reports for... Um, um, or everything through for strikers. Uh, I've got, well, you can see now I've got loads of emails coming through. 
the start simulation. We've got loads of emails coming through for uh, Scout reports, so that's going to be good. There was something else I wanted to say as well, but I forgot. Finally, his overall is moving up slowly. Thank you, Davis. Right, what we got? Final scout report on Tommy Doyle. Do, 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 do. Manchester City, 62. Showing great potential, obviously, we'll shortlist him. Uh, 55. No. Get rid of you. Flynn Downs. We'll shortlist you. Josh Bowler. Uh, b -b -b 61, 20 years old. Uh, you know what? I am going to shortlist that. Sod it. Because he could be a, a good substitute, couldn't he? Uh, no chance I'm going to be able to afford you. What are you sniffing around at, Gims? Uh, 7 million. No. Ain't going to afford you. Uh, 2.8. That's interesting. Showing great potential. We'll shortlist you. Uh, here we go, some strikers now, finally. No chance. And if I'm saying no chance to you, I've got no chance of Che Adams. I've got, oh, so, ah, that wage day, 36,000. That's a lot of money. Wow. But again, wages are far too high. Uh, 25,000 more reasonable so we'll shortlist that <coughs> this next guy i thought it was um there's nothing in there dims you can't fit in the drawer i thought it was jack o'connell like you know the actor from skins um oh wait don't push my hand away uh you know the actor from derby also a derby fan from skins i thought that was because it does look like him i had to wikipedia it just to double check that it wasn't uh, but that's a lot of money for him. He, he doesn't look like that bad a player. Um, so I'll, I'll shortlist him. Just for... Intri no, Kimley, get up, get out my pot noodle. Sorry, guys. My cat is being a little bugger at the minute. Uh, Callum Robinson. I like his haircut. Uh, that's quite cheap, actually. So we'll, we'll shortlist you. Uh, get rid of that. And then Martin Kelly... Uh, that's quite expensive. <coughs> Ashley Williams. Wow, that's a, a name I've not seen in what in late in quite some time. That's quite cheap for a seventy rated, but he is thirty. Oh, he's retiring anyway. Okay, never mind. Kepper. Yeah, do you reckon I could get Kepper? <laughs> no chance. Uh, Bern Bern Leno. No chance. Alisson. No, I don't even know why. These are being scouted. I didn't ask them to be scouted, but hey ho. And Jordan Pickford. No chance. Okay, so there's a few strikers there that are interesting. And then monthly scouting update. Yeah. What are my cats doing? Oh, damn you kittens. Right. 43 to 57, 50 to 64. We're going to say bye to you because there's no chance. Uh, 45 to. 57, 75, interesting, 43, 55, 61 to 77, 36 to 50, 55, 40 to 56, 60 to 84, interesting. It's got a value, of, what was that, 100,000, that's quite nice. Uh, 40 to 56, 56 to 78, that's uh, quite interesting. 37 to 47, eh, he's going to be a terrible one, isn't he? 43 to 59, 70 to 94, 150, wow. 44 to 60, 55 to 73, 35,000. That's going to be not the best, I don't think. Um, okay, we'll let them be scouted further. The problem is, I need to find a defender. Joe Warroyd, he would have been great in that game against Forest. That's a shame, that. <coughs> but, um, yeah, one of my board objectives is to sign a youth defender. So that's what I need to try and keep an eye out for. Demetrius Damanoskos. Uh, the, the, the striker. That's interesting, actually. He's quite cheap. 69 for 26. Uh, I could probably pick him up on the cheap if his contract's expiring. So we'll shortlist him. Have we got any others that I... Oh, yeah. Then I've got the rest that are coming in at, like in the next few days as well. Uh, Jason Bogle's returned from injury, but 
he is going to struggle to fit into this squad as well. I'm going to sim this game against Preston. Uh, Marriott Whitaker. Yeah, I'm going to put Rooney back in the squad. Uh, Rooney. Uh, I'm going to give Waghorn a game as striker. See how he does. Uh, I'm dropping Avocado. He's let me down far too much in the last few games. With his I don't understand why he um he wants to punch a ball rather than catch it. It's frustrating me. It's like Kelly Ruse in real life. He does that a lot. And it, it's stupid, it really is. Right, so they've won, lost and lost. Okay, so hopefully we can get a, a win. Fingers crossed. That would be nice. And um, nope, we lost, but Wagon scored the only goal right at the end. Jesus Christ, so we're not good enough to win sim games. Boss, Curtis Davis, calm your horses. Uh, simulate all. Okay, not too bad. No one else seems to be growing much though. Uh, what we got here, we're not on track. I know, I'm trying. Oh God, I've got a performance review. Could I get sacked in... The board which is the club's currently under scrutiny. The confidence of the board has with the helm of the club is currently waning. Oh, God. Could, what? At least... Oh, great. So we've got a uh, suspension. Uh, Curtis Davis, boss, any fits? Blah, 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 blah. I want to go away and make me stop. Please let me leave so I can play more games. Uh, I'm going to say learn from experience. Okay, so... Curtis Davis wants to go for sale. Okay. So, Joe Warren, please let you be uh, good enough to... Where are you, Joe Warren? Joe Warren. There you are, but he's still slightly injured. But we'll put him in. And then Curtis Davis wants to... I kind of want to keep Davis just for his, like, his regen. But... <coughs> uh, how long? He's 34, so he should be retiring soon, shouldn't he? How long has he got left on his contract? Eight months. You know what, Sonny? I'm going to... Oh, he's already on the uh, transfer list. I know. Oh, and the, the, yeah, it broke down, didn't it? Okay, that's fine. Well, it's not fine, but you know what I mean. And the board's losing all faith in me. But as soon as I, I reach some of my objectives, they should be quite happy with me. Really? Okay. No avocado. You've let me down far too much. Alright, so we're going to jump into this game against Fulham. Uh, bu 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 wow, the squad's completely knackered. Uh, Waghorn for Marriott. Whitaker for... I'm going to have to play Bennett there, I think. Uh, Wisdom for... Where's Bogun? He's still got the injury thing as well. Uh, so we'll take a chance on... Very good. Uh, I'm going to swap Clark. You know what, Davis? I'll give you a chance in this game. Let's see what you can do. I'm going to put Buchanan on this game. Uh, Placervic, I'm going to keep playing. Uh, got Evans in defence. Dowell, Patterson, Cabal, Ahima. Whitaker, Wisdom, Avocado. Right. Let's see how this squad does. Oh God, why has he got space all of a sudden? And it rolls straight in. I have some problems with my goalies, man. I don't know what to do. But where did, where did all that space come from there? I shouldn't have had that space. Offside. That's offside. That, what? No, that's offside. Surely that's offside. Well, the keeper will be frustrated. He thought he'd saved it. He's so unlucky there. It's a good angle from him as well. But it's He's offside. The I'm sure that's offside. I'm not... Where is he? Right, there he is. There. Okay, so... Right, so he's passing. No, nope, he's still running. 
Still running. When's it? Right. Right, so you get the ball. Right, so he's about to pass. Damn it! Damn it! Fine. I'll let you have way. that one. Well done, Austin. Oh, he's almost turning away. He thinks he scored. The goalkeeper doesn't. He takes aim. I'm done. It's over. I'm done. I can't. I can't. I'm frustrated. Uh, I'm absolutely frustrated. What, what is going on? I'm gonna get the sack. Freaking. Uh, right, guys. I lost that episode. That episode. That game. I. I don't want to talk about it. I, I'm absolutely frustrated. I just don't know what to do. Honestly, nothing was going right. This, this, there was no moral or anything in that game. Just a couple of questions. Uh, if Fed says it's a tough match, what do you think went wrong today? The game plan was not followed. There's no dog can do most score today in it. What went wrong? Uh, they were the better team. They were. John Johansson was one of the best players. I was disappointed the way we played. I was. I don't care Thanks about so team much, moral Ron. at the minute. I'm so angry. We've been on like a. Oh, God, shut up, Avocado. I'm going to sell you. Uh, final scout report on Rodrigo Contreras. Right, so let's have a look. Ugo Bonnet. Uh, contract expiring. 1,068.26. We'll short this to you so I can have a look. Uh, Brian Angelo. 23.71. Uh, contract expiring. Interesting. So we'll have a look at you. Uh, Hendrik Wyden. Uh, 71 24 contract expiring. Interesting. Look at that strength. He should be able to hold off some defenders. Uh, Mauricio Asenjo, 66. Contract expiring, 25. Uh, I'm going to say no. Sorry, kiddo. Uh, Marcus Invagaston, 70. Uh, he's not got no. Contract expiring, but he's got some interesting stats, so we'll short this year for potential. Um, 65 contract expire. Oh, no, we'll have to get rid of you. And Virgil Michidian, 26 right wing. Can you play striker? Has that special something quite cheap as well? Uh, he could be the one for the right hand side that I'm missing, so we'll short this to you. Delete you. Uh, suspension over. Cabot's back. Thank you. Uh, I'm not used to want to blow my own trumpet, but I think I would have made an impact against Fuller. Not the right opponent. Don't over. I'm going to tell him not to overreact. I, I, he, I've, I've lost frustration with him as well because the amount of times that he punched the ball away and given the goals away, it's that's frustrated me. Right, I don't even want to play this game. I'm that frustrated, so I'm just going to sim it. Sorry, I don't care. Win or lose, I, at this point. I'm done. I just want to finish this episode. I don't care. I'm that annoyed. And we get a win. Thank you. And Rooney scores. <sighs> Not much of a... Well, it is and it isn't, I guess. Performance review. Here we go. We're going to get the sack. Uh, come on. Go to training. Buchanan's gone up to 61 finally. <sighs> Let's read these emails. Uh, performance with Bud Richardson forming the position with the club. It's currently under scrutiny. Yes, I know. I'm working on that. You'll have to bear with me. You squad. You squad. Scat, yeah. Uh, right. Uh, I don't know if I want to promote him or not. Because 48 is a low thing. Into 40, again, 48. Right, guys. I am going to end this episode here. Uh, I'm just going to go back to the board over the jet to see. That's the critical one. So I've got to finish the season with a profit margin of 27 million. I'm not going to do that. I think I'm at like 6 million at the minute. Uh, they want me to gain automatic promotion um, to 
to the championship, uh, to the Premier League, but I doubt I'm going to do that. If I can make playoffs, that might save my job. And then they want me to sign at least three players younger than 20 years old with potential greater than the average overall rating of the players currently in the same position. Right, so I need to look for youth players then. I'm guessing that can be in the transfer market, not just the, um, the youth squad, youth academy. So I might have a look through some of those. Uh, and then that could save me. <sighs> sign to youth players, sign to the defender position. I can't find any defenders just yet. Sign one, one crucial first team players assigned to a forward position. <sighs> it's going to be a tough season. I don't know why it's going crap. It... <sighs> I'm not happy with nothing at the minute. The squad's just completely letting me down. Um, I just don't know what to do. Is it? Austin's gone up by one. That's interesting. Can I add him to the... Uh, he's, I think he's added to the transfer list, isn't he? Uh, Max Lowe's gone up by two. Buchanan's gone up by three. Clark's gone up by one. Worrell's gone up one, by one. Davis has gone down. Wisdom's gone up by one. Bogle, Shinny. Felix gone up by three. What are you worth? Five million now. Not too bad. Uh, Evans has gone up, Plasvik's gone up, Patterson, Knight's gone up by three, Bird's gone up by three, Dowell, Holmes has gone up by one, Bennett's gone up by one, um, Marriott's gone up by one, Whitaker's gone up by two, that's that's uh, that's alright I guess, but I still need to flesh this squad out a bit, definitely. But anyway guys, thank you very much for watching, I do hope you all have enjoyed the episode. Um, I think the highlight of the episode for me has got to be the Max Lowe goal, that bicycle kick from the corner. What can I say? Um, so please do leave a like if you enjoyed the episode or you enjoyed Max Lowe's goal. And please do subscribe to the channel if you haven't already to see if I do keep my job at, my job, my job at Derby County. Um, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Take care. Bye.